You know, people who are superstitious say that number 13 is unlucky. But I've got a good feeling about this episode. I feel like this is going to be the one where we don't lose any mons. We're going to smash through some tasks. I know we've got to get through these haunted forests or haunted woods, but I don't know what we've got to do after. We'll work it out as we go. And we're going to have some good battles. And we're going to level up. Maybe something will evolve. I've got a good feeling about this episode. Let's do it. Oh, and also, hi. Welcome. This is episode 13. I'm saying now. This is Pokemon Brand Uzlock. So, uh, since the last episode, I had a run back to Pokemon Center, healed up, come and got back into the Haunted Forest, and now we're ready to smash this, uh, this lady, this channeler, and her Ekans. Now, why has she got an Ekans if she's a channeler? Shouldn't she be channeling ghosts? Unless that's the ghost of an Ekans, and that is actually pretty spooky. Maybe this is a sign, actually, you know, it's episode 13, spooky things are happening, I'm in the Haunted Woods in episode 13. So this is basically like pre-Halloween. You know, but like months pre-Halloween. Mm. I don't know if that name will catch on. It's probably not going to be a public holiday anytime soon. So, I haven't changed anybody on my team, obviously. I got Haunter in the last episode. And I'm thinking that what I'm going to do is keep him up front for a little bit, try and switch train him and leveler and also save you, try and get you off level 40, but yeah, we'll see how we go. It might be that we get another encounter soon and then I can, uh, then I might not want to haunt anymore either, so we'll see how it goes. Also the trainers around here have all got level 28, sort of 30-ish Pokemon, uh, and Casper's only 25, so he's got some serious catching up to do, but it can be done. Wow, that's very, oh, it's very hard. I know it's a few levels higher, but I thought because I was the the evolved version, I'd be slightly more effective. Oh, and Ghastly goes for Hypnosis. Perfect. No, no, actually, that shouldn't do too much. I'm a rock type. Why would a ghost type? Oh, and I wake up straight away, so that's good. Now, what can I throw that will actually hit this thing? I guess rock throw. Go to the Nightshade again, which is going to hit. Don't crit, don't crit. Thank you very much. And Rock Throw misses. Well, I can do another one as long as it does not critical. Lick does nothing, but it does get the Paralysis. And I get the Rock Throw up anyway. That's the end of you, Ghastly. And that Ghastly is causing me trouble, man. So that Ghastly is causing me trouble, man. Bitch needs to get hearing tested. So, let's use a Super Potion on Casper. And on Leveler, I can't be able to heal the Paralysis, so... I'm just going to have to wait it out. Very good. So, my next move, let's teleport over. Another battle. I, I, I mean, this one of the forest is like the reimagining of the Pokemon Tower, right, from Gen 1. And there's a lot of battles in there, and there's also... When you get to the end of it, you go up a set of stairs or whatever, and then you have to battle like a million members of Team Rocket to save Mr. Fuji. So I'm guessing this, which so far has sort of mimicked the events of, of Kanto with different storylines in different orders, I'm guessing it's going to be the same sort of thing. Goes for the Nightshade. Man, it's hitting hard with those Nightshades. And if it hits me again, it, I should survive unless it crits. And I outspeed. Oh, this is a risky training method, man. Ugh, I go for it, though. Yeah, you gotta try it. Gotta try it. What's life without a little bit of uh, adventure? A bit of risk? However, I'm not gonna take on Mr. Evis. So, let's get our saviour out there. Our good friend Blastoise. The starter man, the man that started this whole Nuzlocke the second time around after Bulbasaur died already. Supersonic causes confusion, but I can battle through it. Ah, I'll save you! Supersonic again, not very clever. And I'm no longer confused, and there's the bite. It's a critical hit, it's super effective. Mystery of us goes down! And this lady doesn't know what hit her. What? She literally doesn't know what hit her. It's literal. And we 
have a full heal. Oh, that's good. We can heal the paralysis off of our... Um, oh, what's his flipping name? Oh, hang on. I've got paralyzed heals. Let's use that. Leveler. That's the one. Shiny stone. Don't know what that does. Lots of things I, I keep saying in episodes. Oh, I need to research this. I need to research this. And then I just... By the time I finish the episode, I forgot. First person shooters are boring, she says. I don't know, man. I think first, per first person shooters can be pretty fun. In fact, I've just heard... Well, I didn't hear. As I was flicking through Twitter earlier, I saw someone saying something about Battlefield 5. Some information has been released about it. So I need to look into that later as well. So I like me a little bit of Battlefield. Although I haven't played Battlefield 1 in quite a long time. So I lost interest in it a little bit. Got a little bit boring. Meh. Let's get a leveler out there. And get some rock throws off. It's gonna do like nothing. That's a crit as well, it just does absolutely nothing. Unless it paralyzes and then I'll just have a little cry. There it is! Boo hoo, there's my little cry. Fuck off. <sighs> Two turns in a row fully paralyzed. Three turns in a row fully paralysed. What kind of luck is this? Oh, this is going to be close. Four turns in a row fully paralysed. That's ridiculous. Game's got my number. That's okay, because I've got a bite on this fella right here. And he's going to eat you up. There we go, boy. It's a dark type, so it's super effective. Everyone gets some experience. Chandler gets smashed. Oh, <laughs> what? These Chandlers really don't know what's going on, do they? I feel like maybe they're in a bit of a... I don't know. What's the word? Like a trance. Maybe they're like a little bit possessed. And then I absolutely destroy them in battle. And they're like... Snap back to life. Back to reality. Know what's going on again. Uh, and yes, we can save you one as well. So, next thing. Mm, yes, we'll use it for you. Probably only going to get paralysed again, because I'm probably going to come up against about 50 more Ghastlies that have got Lick. But, never mind. We have ourselves another battle. This lady. I need moons! <laughs> we'll just get some moons. You could get Pokemon Moon, you could get Pokemon Ultra Moon, you could go and catch a Lunatone. Whoa, all the moon. You could get a Moonstone and evolve a Clefairy. Supersonic, but it misses. Nightshade is not going to miss, though. Oh, it doesn't do that much damage, though. And the Supersonic. To be fair, though, it is level 30, I'm level 25. Like, I do see why it's not doing much damage. I'm not completely stupid. You're completely stupid because you went for Supersonic and then went for Confuse Ray, which is the same move pretty much. And Screech. So he's got three moves that are not damaging moves. So I wonder what his fourth one is. Supersonic again to get that confusion. Could be hit. That could be it. Oh, it just sticks in there. Supersonic fails. I'll get you with another Nightshade, my friend. Oh, you're just dragging it out, aren't you? Just dragging it out. There we go. That's my lad, Casper. Down the go. And Casper gets his first level since I've caught him. I like that as well. Good stuff. Again, I still haven't looked up how these things evolve. I've now got two trade evolutions. Well, two Pokemon that evolve via trade on my team. So I really need to know what I need to do with those to get them evolved. Because I could do with the power of having a Golem and a uh, Gengar on the team. Okay, I know what I need to do here. I need to go like that and then come back in like that. There we are. HP up. Useful. Let's have a quick look up. Oh. Let's see where this takes us. 
to that man. More items, yes. Super repel. You know what? I might make use of that while I'm in here because why not? So now we can have a little bit of peace and quiet. We know Pokemon coming after us. So there's a battle. What we got up here? Oh, a battle. Uh, stop and swap is. Stop and swap? I ain't never heard of it. And swap with an L as well. Stop and swoop. Swoop. Swap. Swoop. Yeah, still not doing very much. I hate Confuse Ray so much. I've got it, so I might use it as well. In fact, I might start using it more often. I don't always, I don't normally think about confusing my opponent. It doesn't. Like I just want to hit them, but maybe when I'm in a place where they keep confusing me, I sort of need to level the playing field out a little bit. Confuse no more. Uses confuse ray, and it hits, and you're confused, and you're probably going to hit me anyway because, because of course you are, because that's what happens when I'm playing Pokemon. I get shit luck. Da. Well, I can't, uh, well, it's, it's done now. Let's get Saviour out of here. Oh, that is so annoying. To be fair though, that is my fault because I was spending too much time trying to get my own move off and not looking at what HP I had left. Not paying attention. You can tell I'm a Nuzlocke noob. Because I've got to pay attention to those things. Ah. <sighs> Absolute waste of a Pokemon. See now, do these are all uh, 21, 21. Like, do I bother training one of those? No, no, I don't. I'm not gonna. Wait, no, that's the way I came in. So now I need to go as this way. That's gonna heal me, right? Yeah. Saints Pokemon are fully healed. She won about all though. Nope, she's just going to let me heal up there. Oh, she's so good, isn't she? Good lass. Not all of these channelers are uh, nasty pasties. So let's take on this channeler here. CHILD! She hates children. She, she, she hates them so much, she sends ghosts with teeth out. That are gas balls to finish them off. And then they lick you. You really shouldn't go around licking children, Channeler. The police are going to be after you. Oh, and I finished that one. Rock Throw's really good against these ghost Pokemon. Ha! Uh, do we get around to take her on? Yeah. <laughs> Useless dialogue. It's as if he knows when he made this game that this dialogue gets skipped by almost everyone that plays. Apart from Let's Players, who read it out, like me, for three idiots. So, Nightshade. Honestly, I've seen so many Nightshades this episode. Go for the rock throw. One more of those, yeah. Easy. Easy breezy. Oh, it's so beautiful out today. I'm going to go out into the garden, and I'm going to do some weeding. And I've got a big plant box out there that needs taken apart. I'm gonna get outside, get some rays, get some of that vitamin D. Vitamin D without even having to drink any sunny D. And I must be going the right way. Let's just drop a potion on my man. My boy. Level up. That's the one. And then I can take on this hoe. Right hell! Wow, that's not a very nice attitude to have towards me. Like, I'm literally only walking through here to... I mean, I don't even know why I'm walking through here. The narrative hasn't really explained it to me. So, we're going to go with the rock throw again. I go to Confuse Ray. But, yeah, see, I, sometimes confusion does go my way. That's nice. And rock throw. I can't believe how much dice that's doing. 
Ah, but hypnosis, that is going to put me on my bum. But I've got something up my sleeve. Some awakenings here. It's going to be a bullet, that's probably going to paralyse me. <laughs> no, <laughs> good. And I get to the rockstar again. Confused Ray fails. I'm already confused, that's why. But I. Oh man, I get through the confusion but miss the turn. That's so annoying. Flicks are critical. Confused. And this time I hurt myself. Oh, come on. I'm sick of this. Gotta get this done, man. Confused no more. Throw to the But misses again. Okay, we can afford one more go at this. And now he gets the hypnosis. And I've either got to switch or heal. And I'm going to heal. Because I want this guy to get all the experience from this battle. So lick, I'm happy with that, and I'm gonna. Uh, do I just ride this sleep part, or do I use my last awakening? Uh, if it keeps doing that, I'm gonna have to use it. But this side it goes for lick. I don't think am I confused anymore? No, but I'm paralysed. But I get the rock throw off anyway. Whoa, man, that was tight. Tight. Gasp. Satan forever! Yeah! Oh, God. Sorry, I got a bit excited about Satan. <laughs> By the way, I'm not a Satanist. Uh, just putting that out there. Don't at me. Super potion. I don't have anything to heal the paralysis. Nope. So, uh, yeah, we'll just have to get on with that then. Where to now, my friends? Oh, well, that's, well, that's, not, that's an unavoidable battle, so that's fine. No, I'm not getting tired. I'm having a great time, actually. I'm uh, having fun. Battling a shitload of ghastlies. Dying to a shitload of ghastlies. Getting paralysed by a shitload of ghastlies. It's, it's, it's ghastly mania running wild. Anyway, she goes for the nightshade. Oh, why am I missing this rock throw? So much. Lick. I'm already paralysed, so at least it can't do that to me. And Rock Throw finishes it in one. And we go for Mistrevious. Uh, no, I'm not going to change. Even though Mistrevious has got Psy Wave, I think, at this level. Oh, and there it is. As if by magic. It's like I knew. But it doesn't do anything, so that's cool. Come on! Missing so many rock throws, and I guarantee you that the next one I'll, I will get paralyzed, so now I can't throw it all. There it is, level is fully paralyzed. <laughs> now it goes for confused race, so I'm paralyzed and confused, and I'm missing rock throws. So basically, oh, come on, what are the chances? I can, come on, I can do another one, I know. Just get one more off. Yeah, leveler! Ah, I've always believed in you, my friend. get to the next level as well and he's trying to learn an earthquake which is sick because that can hit the ghosts yes and we will go for what have we got harden it's gonna have to be self-destruct because that just means that there's now no chance that I'm accidentally gonna click self-destruct Chandler is about to use horn to away change Pokemon yes because level is in a pretty bad position right now confused and paralyzed that's not what you need in life Octazooka. Oh, and he gets the poison as well. Actually, it's not going to do shit. Poison hits. Yeah, and I'll just hit it with some of it. Yeah, bite probably. I'll well, finish it off. Gotta remember that that bite is super effective against ghosts because I keep forgetting about it and not using it. Da -da -da -da. Got a level 40 on the team. Power. Okay, so there's a teleport here. Uh, let's just. Your game is erased. No, it's not! Oh, don't do that to me, Kangaskan. Wait, this. 
Right, hang on. Now let me think about this. Because this is a static encounter. It's a Pokemon you have to encounter through the game to get... It's not... Yeah. I feel like this is good. I feel like I can catch this. I feel like the rules say I can. Oh, it's a predicament. Oh, yeah, it's a static. That's it. I've decided. It's a static encounter, and we're going to go for it. I mean, who's who's checking the rules anyway? And now I'm going to leave it there and try a couple of balls. Oh, I don't want... I don't want to be a cheat, but... It's a static encounter, so if I can catch it, it's... Here we go. Yeah, you're mine, boy. Yes, I will give a nickname to Kangaskhan and we'll call it Mom. Call it Mom. Oh, so every time you do that, you battle a Kangaskhan. That's crazy. So, so what do I do? So, I've got a virus scan, and I feel like that's the item, but I can't give it to anybody, I don't think. No, because you don't do that in this generation. And every time I do that, it keeps pushing me away. Try just facing that spot and using it. Nope. Oh dear. What you gotta say? It's gotta be. Mm. There's a way to get to that teleport spot. But how? Let's try and get one earthquake off on this guy and then. If it doesn't go, we can swap out to save it. Oh, we hit him, that's what. One hit. Key! You are soft as sheets, my friend. Get our leveler heal back up so we can stay out front. And. Oh. Stuff! Stuff. Just got to stuff to she. Mistrievous. So cute looking in this. Level uh, Let's try the, the earthquake again. Full paralysis. But Ma will give it another go because he's just going to go for confusion type moves. Try and get confused. Earthquake is good. Hits. Oh, very close. We'll get a rock fair off as well. Come on, push through that confusion. Push through that paralysis. You little. Confused no more. Paralysis doesn't hit. Rock fair actually hits. Love it when the plan comes together, my guy. Yes. And we carry on. Ooh. Iron. Perfect. I hate it when my clothes don't get ironed. And a rare candy. Beautiful stuff. Oh. But, okay. Well, now this worries me because I've not picked up an I. Yeah. I've not picked up an item to, um. get me through here. And I don't really know what I'm supposed to do to get through here. Which puts me in a bit of a predicament. Time place for everything. Mm. You said that, but. Hmm. 
try putting that as the first item. I don't feel like that's going to do anything, but it's worth a go. My game isn't erased! I don't understand why you're telling me that. I mean, maybe, I, oh, maybe it's because I have to kill this thing. I don't know. I mean, I caught it, didn't I? Well, maybe that's not the right thing. Maybe I have to kill it. Rage is building. I feel like if you have to kill it to get through the game, then catching it probably isn't, isn't a Nuzlocke-friendly thing to do. To catch it and then just go back and kill it. Let's see if that works anyway. So it's dead. The missing no was really just a Kangaskhan. She learned her lesson. The missing nose vanished. Okay. Yeah, I guess I need to throw away that Kangaskhan then, but... Oh well. Oh yeah, and here we are again with Team Rockets to take on. So, let's take on these Team Rockets, see where we end up after that, and then I think that will just about be time to end this episode. What's this guy got to say? What do you want? Why are you here? You know what? I don't really know why I'm here. I picked up an item which made me come this way, and then that's the end of it. And it's a Zubai. I haven't seen one of them for a while, to be fair, so... I'm not sick to the back teeth of you yet, Zubat. Oh, but he's flying time, so that earthquake's not a good idea anyway. Even if it does hit. Which it doesn't, because paralysis is the rock throw, which is much better against flying types. But it misses because nothing that I throw ever hits ever. Oh, come on. This is just such a shit situation to be in. It doesn't really have anything that can hit me hard. And now I flinch. Could you possibly give me another way to not hit? <sighs> Save is the man. You're a flying type, so ice beam's good. Yes! Get down, sunshine. And we'll get some levels. I need some experience. Sand slash. Yes, we're going to switch back again. Even though I'm probably just going to switch straight back out, but it's really gravel that needs the experience. So uh, there's no point keeping Savior out there. And then Savior can hit this guy. Probably Octazooka him. One, one go, straight down. Thanks for coming. I love that that Octazooka's got like a poison uh, chance with it as well. I think that's brilliant. And Golbat is a flying type. So we'll just stick out for this one and just get the ice beam in. Finish him off. And move on to the next rocket member. Oh man, he survives just some bulk right there and it confuses but if you only have to hit one move get the bite and it's done no it's a bite of its own now this could get tense if you don't hit now yeah nice one damn right you give up I'm not going to forget this scary oh I'm scared of you Mr. Team Rocket uh, I'm not. Spoiler alert. So let's get the team looking that beautiful and take on the next rocket. I magically had 99 rare candies in my bag. <laughs> it's a missing no joke. I love it. And it comes in with a grimer. Minimise, but it's Earthquake. Do you know what? I just don't get that. Earthquake should hit. It doesn't matter if you're minimised. You're still on the ground. Like, the Earthquake's going to hit you. God, I hate Grimer. Apart from my Grimer, who uh, died a couple of episodes, episodes ago, Grimace, that may uh, never be forgotten. Oh! Disrespect this grimer is showing me right now. I don't 
Don't disable. No. Ah. There we go. Rock throw, the one move that never hits, hits. But I've got no... Oh, man, I've used a lot of rock throws this game. I've even nearly run out of earthquakes. Man, this is bad. Oh, what this idiot. Hey, there we go. Grandma has gone. Da -da -da -da. Lick it on. Mmm. Now I'm gonna stick to look at lick it on. Look at that tongue. Got that bacon in his mouth. So earthquakes normal. Yeah, just hits normally. I've only got earthquake to use. No more. <coughs> wow. See ya. Uh... Oh, these rocket members are really mardy when they lose. Let's get us some. Wait, where's my potions? I've just gone past them. Yeah, you'll do. These on this guy. And now, my dudes, I feel like it's this one and then maybe another one afterwards, but. This could also be the last one. Deja vu, huh? Yes. Most certainly. It's almost like I've played this in a different game. Now he comes in with the Onyx. And we're going to go with... Dynamic Punch. Fighting type against Rock type. That's good, right? That works. Can't move. Bind. Oh, it's such a stalling tactic. Go for the Rage again. That's not going to do much either. Oh, fully paralysed. I can't wait to get out of this place and get healed up. I could have walked back and healed up where that level, where that level, where that channel was. You know, where she had that purified, purified square. But poor uh, time it would take. But to be fair, it probably would have been quicker than working through all this paralysis. Come on, man! Hit them move. Critical hit doesn't do much though. Paralysed again. A waiting game, isn't it? Paralyzed again. Let me guess. Oh, we hit it. We hit it. Next, we go for Ditto. Mm, yes, I'm gonna change Pokemon. Because Ditto's only move is Transform. So let's dig. Transform. And by the time it's transformed, that'll come up from the dig. And there it is. Very good. And now, bite. Go to Rock Tazuka. That'll be very effective, but could poison. Doesn't. Bite's good. One more bite. Oh no. More to be done. Ice Beam again, not very effective. Him again, not very effective. See how speedy he be. Like, he's evolved, he's, he's changed into me, and yet somehow he's faster than me. It's back to use Kingler. Well, Graveler would be weak against Kingler, so let's keep this man out here and keep biting. Good move. Vice grip. Ooh, kid. Tell you what, though, Kingler does have the uh, guillotine. Which is a one hit KO. Ariados. Uh, no, nope, we'll stick in. Yeah, that's one thing I don't want to come across in this generation is one hit KO moves. Particularly if uh, the NPCs use X accuracies, because I have seen them use X attacks and X speeds and X defenses already. So if you use an X accuracy and then go for the guillotine or another one hit KO move, I am absolutely fucked. Gah, not again. No. Yeah, I don't think there's another battle, so I'm just talk straight to this guy. But he's called Mr. Rumiko. Hey, kid, you beat them all by yourself. Why does everyone call me kid? I'm 26. But yes, me and my Pokemon did it, even with that Kangaskhan nearby. Well, for saving me, I have a special gift to give you. Let's get out of this dark forest, first of all. Yeah, I agree. Let's do it. Let's go see our man.
Sane, you will need this item to continue in your quest. It's a very popular item. Pokeflu! Beautiful. Upon hearing Pokeflu, sleeping Pokemon will spring awake. It works on all sleeping Pokemon. Oh, awesome. Pokemon Monthly. <laughs> Okay, so that's that's a good thing to have, Poke Flute. Um, I don't know where I'm gonna have to use it though. I don't think I've run into have I run into where the Snorlax is yet? Yeah, I don't know about that. Well, uh, let's go back to in fact no, you know what? This is a good time to end the episode because then I can work out what I need to do next before I record another one, whenever that's gonna be. So Thank you all very much for watching this episode. Next time I'm going to go work out where we need to go. Uh, I feel like yeah, there is somewhere where I've seen a Snorlax and now I've got that poker flute. Makes sense to probably go there and try and get past it. See where we end up next. So again, thanks for watching. If you've been enjoying the videos, then make sure you like, hit the button, subscribe, hit that button. And uh, yeah, I'll, you'll get a notification when I do a next video. And I'll see you next time. Thank you very much for watching. Peace.